Hey friends, this is Ms. Stapp with a quick tutorial on how to download your podcast so that you can embed it in your website. So I chose that route because I didn't want to really publish my podcast. I created this and I added a sponsor message that isn't real. And I just wanted this to be a private file that I could share directly with my teacher on my website. So if that's you, this will be the tutorial for you. So what you're seeing right now is Anchor and you're at the dashboard. I'd like you to click on Episodes. From Episodes, you can see that I've got one in there. It's a little tester, it doesn't sound like much and you're gonna hear it. But when I click on these right-hand side where you have these three little dots, it gives me some options. I can view the episode details. I can copy a link to the episode, but this is what I want. I wanna download this episode. I don't wanna delete it, download. Now, when I push download, I thought, huh, that really is my episode. You can hear it. But that's not my download. And then I looked in my file and I didn't see a download. What happened? Well, Anchor has another step for you right over here on the right hand side. Click again and look, there is another download. Let's click that and see what happens. Then on my device over here on the left hand side, you can see that download popped up. You can see it's an M4A. It's actually a WAV file because that is the kind of device I have. And that is the software that's available on my device that um, can be a video or recording like this. So now what I want to do is I'm going to need to convert this into some kind of file that I can put onto Canva. So let's open it up and see what happens. There it is again. Uh, but I need my file. So here we go. I'm going to look in downloads and see what happened there. I've practiced this a few times. You can tell this most recent, this is the file that I want, but I need to convert it. It's an M4A WAV file. It's nothing I can use. Don't worry. And Stapp has you covered. So I did a little research to find a converter. I found one that it was freeconvert.com and then I kind of worried about my computer safety. So I went online and I found some reviews. Freeconvert.com is another advanced online window converter tool, completely free and secure. Supports 350 video conversions and it's simple. Okay? I feel relatively safe about this, even though I haven't used it before and I'm gonna try it out. When I open the site, it says WAV to MP4 converter, and that's what I've got. So I'm going to choose my file by clicking on choose file. And here's what I need converted. Let's open it up. It says, gives me some options, MP4 and so forth. I want to convert it to an MP4. An MP4 is a video if you're not familiar with that. So let's convert this to an MP4. Great. Now I need to download it. And this is where you worry about the safety. I've used this before and I can tell you based on the reviews that I looked at and myself, I haven't had any problems. I'm gonna download my MP4. And just to make sure it works, there it is. Now I do understand you may not like this black screen. That's my episode. You may not like this black screen, and there are many other ways to do this. I was looking for, I think on my website, I'm going to have an image, and then you click on it and you go to this podcast, which is fine. If you would rather create, take this audio and place it on a YouTube or something where you have an image, you can certainly do that. This is just a quick and easy way for me. I will have the link to that file converter for you on the website. Again, um, I don't get paid anything. I've just used it safely myself. So it is an available option for you. You can go to my website and see where I've placed this um, as an example. Uh, again, what are we doing here? We are downloading our Anchor episode onto our desktop 
and then we are converting the file to be an mp4 so that we can place it on our website and the staff and other people that are looking at our website can have access to that file and we don't have to publish our podcast out there in the world well that's all i got and i want to stop my recording now